All right, today, everybody, we're going to quickly look at how do I find the persons that I want to be friends with, and most importantly, how do I private my profile if I don't want to be seen in the registry of members all right i don't want anybody to be my friend so i'm going to private my profile and so nobody can see me and so basically that's what we're looking at today all right so you're going to notice that i have logout account contact member and user you're not familiar with member because that was not there. Some of you, you're very quick and I must commend you. As soon as I add anything to the website, you know, and I am happy about that. Okay, so I clicked on member and this portal um, came up. Now, at the top, if you want to search for somebody via email, via whether they're online, via first name, username, it's there. And so you can click on it and you can search, right? So I want to search. And when you search, you enter the data and you click search and it comes up. Now, you can also... Click so the users are here, and I see that a few persons are adding, adding sorry, photographs and power to you. Great, and I'm scrolling down at the end of the page. You can see that there are other pages, so there are quite a few persons on the site. What you can also see is that there are 12 profiles per page. So for example, if I want to, and I'm going back up, if I want to send somebody, I was checking this out, so I send this person, this person, and I'm going to send this person. I want, I want them to be my friend. I want them to be my friend. So I'm sending them a friend request. Now, it also shows me that they're offline. So they're offline now, but hopefully when they come back online, they will accept my friend request and we can be friends. Hopefully. Let's see. Then, now that I've sent my friend request, if I want to see or track how many fr friend requests I have I've sent, I can go to my profile and notice guys i was able to put my tag i i am going to click on friends and then i will see i'm seeing i have no friends nobody wants to be my friend i have no friend request. Nobody has sent me any friend request, but I've sent four friend requests. So I'm sending four requests. And I've sent these persons friend requests. And when they accept, so it's kind of like Facebook. If you search for the people you want to be friends with, you send them a friend request. Some of them will say yes. Some of them will say no. When you are friends, you guys can talk to each other. So you can communicate. So if you're there, for example, you're on the site with your classmates, you're on the site with your colleagues, you can um, be friends with each other and share information talk about posts, all of this, and, and all of this can be done via activity, talking to each other. So you can see what your friends, they have posted. Um, you can also see, you can comment on their posts. So for example, I made a post on my wall and you can like it, you can comment, you can do all of that. And so 
it's it we're coming on we're coming on all right so let us now talk about how to private um information so i am going to account and in my account there is a section for account change password privacy notification and if i want to delete my account so i don't want to delete my account at this moment in time but i want to update my privacy setting and it says profile so the first thing it says profile and basically who can see your profile everyone and i can say yeah no so you can select only me friends only so if you have friends you can put that they are the only ones who can see your profile or if you don't have any friends only me or if you don't want any friends only me so if your profile is on only me nobody will see you. nobody will be able to find you to be your friend so to speak right then you have here you can hide yourself from appearing in so you can now say i don't want to appear in this members section right up here that i just went through and so you can click yes and you won't appear right there all right if you don't want people to know when you're online <laughs> and i can understand that you can also change from no to um yes hide hide your your okay now additionally your wall okay can and you can say public meaning everybody members persons who are members are only me members meaning persons who are signed up to the site all right so after you have done that then you update you click update your privacy and immediately the new settings that you have done will be updated all right and the same thing for notification i have got a new friend and then you can click whether or not you want to be sent an email notification to say someone sent you a friend request or you can click do not click it and you won't get any notification and so that way it's it's we're trying to create a more sense of community um for now this aspect is available to members and csec pro members as we go on this is a trial version as um the system continues to work i will then make a decision as to whether or not how i will proceed in terms of offering this feature so if you do not have a membership profile you won't be able to access members because in your regular for example let me log out let me log out and guys, I am kind of signed in right now as administrator. So I'm going to log out and then you're going to realize, oh, it's above my page. So when you log out, you're only going to see login, register, account, contact. That's it. You won't be able to see members. So if you're not a member of the site, you can't find, be friends with anybody. You can't do any of like that and to be a member of the site it is completely free at this moment in time it is absolutely free members are not able to access anything in the shop for free csec english csec pro users are able to access everything in the shop and specific csec pro items that are in the blog so bear that in mind as we proceed thank you guys have a great day have a great night great morning when whenever you view this bye, -bye.